pwede mo na ding sabihin na, oh, tama pala ang sinabi ni Martin Heidegger na mag-shrink ang uh, time at distance. So, yung malalayo, pwede nang mag -i... Hello guys! How are you? I hope that you are doing well. Okay, so today I'm going to talk about the essence of technology. And I would also like to take this opportunity to commend Miss Mary Jane Pasignanen for requesting this video because this video is very interesting since we are talking about technology. Actually, the word technology is the bottom line of globalization. But how? Okay, so malalaman natin yan pagkatapos ng video na ito. And by the way, bago tayo magsimula, sigurad, siguraduhin nyo munang nakapag-like and subscribe kayo sa channel ko para maging updated kayo sa mga susunod kong videos. Alright, so let's start! In this video, we are talking about the essence of technology. But before that, uh, let us define it first. We have to know the meaning of technology. So, ikaw, ano sa tingin mo ang ibig sabihin ng technology? Pwede bang magsulat ka dyan sa comment section kung ano ang sa tingin mo ang ibig sabihin ng technology? From all the searches I had, I was able to check on its definition and it says that technology is the branch of knowledge that deals with the creation and uh, use of technical means and their interrelation with life and it also it is also the application of knowledge for practical ends. As I understand technology is the product of human knowledge which aims to aid human activities and if these are manipul uh, I mean uh, if these are created by them it means that they are manipulated by them say for example the cell phones or the smartphones will you consider this as technology probably you will say yes because it is true but the question is why are these created or why are these manufactured Maybe ang sasagot ninyo dyan ay para magkaroon ng communication or para magkaroon ng uh, contact sa ating mga families or yung mga relatives natin sa ibang bansa or yung mga mahal natin sa buhay na nasa malayong lugar. For technology was really created for a purpose. Now we will talk about the essence or the importance of uh, technology. So, dahil alam mo na kung ano ang ibig sabihin ng teknolohiya, pwede bang magsulat ka na naman dyan sa comment section kung ano ang magandang naranasan mo dahil sa teknolohiya. Alam ko na kapag napakinggan mo ito, mapapaisip ka or uh, may imagine mo or maaalala mo si Martin Heidegger. Sa naisulat niyang speech entitled The Question Concerning Technology which was published in 1954. He focused on the essence of technology. He discussed the relationship of technology and people and one of the uh, thing that, things that he considered as the essence of technology and people is that distances in time and space are shrinking. Why do you think this became the sole importance of technology to us or to people. He tried to focus it on his statements which says distances in time and space are shrinking. In order for us to further understand his statement, may I request you to close your eyes for 5 seconds and imagine yourself that you are staying in an environment away from your family without any means of transportation and communication at gusto mong uh, makausap or makauwi sa inyong pamilya pero wala kang magawa dahil wala ng vehicles and kahit sa komunikasyon ay uh, hindi mo magawa dahil uh, walang uh, cellphone or wala man lang uh, means of communication. Okay, so I'll give you 5 seconds to do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Okay, so tapos na. Alright, so may I ask kung ano ba ang nararamdaman mo? Natakot ka ba? Or uh, nasasabit ka ba? Or ano? Ano yung mga naiimagine mo sa 5 seconds na yan? Pwede bang isulat mo dyan sa comment section para makita ko kung may natutunan ka sa video na ito. I guess you are thinking this uh, question. So, ano kaya ang ginagawa ng mga lolo at lola ko noon? Paano kaya sila nabuhay? 
paano sila maglakad. So, ibig sabihin, kung walang komunikasyon, so, hindi na sila nakikipag, uh, hindi na sila nag-uusap. So, kung may, uh, may nagtrabaho sa ibang bansa, eh, kailangan umuwi muna siya bago sila makapag-usap. Tapos, kung gusto niyang pumunta sa ibang bansa or ibang lugar, maglalakad na lang siya. Napakahirap naman nito. Ang hirap naman ang buhay nila noon. So, mapapa, mapapaisip ka na totoo yung sinabi ni Martin Heidegger tungkol sa essence ng technology. Mapaisip ka na ngayon na mas mabuti na pala ngayon dahil meron na ang teknolohiya. Dahil uh, sa ngayon, pwede na akong manood ng tutorial at matututo ako. Hindi ko na kailangang pumasok sa school or hindi ko na kailangang puntahan ang bahay ni teacher bago ko malaman kung ano ang sagot or bago niya ma-explain ito sa akin. And then, uh, marami. Pwede mo nang matawagan si X. I mean, si... Huwag <laughs> naman nang si X. Pwede mo nang matawagan si... Kung sino, kung sino ang mahal mo sa buhay at yung mga kaibigan mo. At pwede mo na ding sabihin na, oh, tama pala ang sinabi ni Martin Heidegger na mag-shrink ang uh, time at distance. So, yung malalayo, pwede nang magi lumalapit. So, yan pala ang ibig sabihin ni Martin Heidegger sa essence of technology niya. Ito na din pumapasok ang mga hugot natin sa buhay. Uh, gaya na to, it's so far yet so near. So, ang layo-layo pero feeling malapit lang. So, mas maganda yan kesa yung sasabihin mo na it's so near yet so far. So, mas maganda pala yung teknolohiya dahil nga yan. Dahil uh, kahit sa hugot natin sa buhay, maa-apply yan. Now, I will ask you again. What is the essence of technology? So, that is a question. Simple. The essence of technology is globalization. Alright, so dahil sa teknolohiya, meron tayong globalization or nagkaroon tayo ng globalization. Did it answer my question on the first part? Alright, so if you want to watch more about my uh, discussion or talks about globalization, please see the link down below. I will be uh, including the link para balikan nyo yung discussion ko na yun para makakonect kayo dito sa topic na ito. Alright, so that's all for today and I hope that you like this and I hope that you learned something from this video. And if you have some question, please don't hesitate to uh, write it down in the comment section. And by the way, yung mga hindi pa po nakapag-subscribe sa channel ko, please uh, don't forget to like this video and subscribe on my YouTube channel in order for you to be updated on my next video. Alright, so goodbye guys!